Yo guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video of the day. The day, this video guys is a message to all the haters and almost everyone that pretty much disses me, doesn't like me, you know what? And also it's the same to some of my friends and some of my family. It's a message to them as well. Now, before we begin, hit comment, like and subscribe and all we did and smash the like button. Let's see about 220 likes, that will be amazing. Also, if you are subscribed to James McGonagall, there's all his links in the description. Get me 555 subscribers and you're a legend. Now let's get into it. Now, honestly, I could say a million things right now about so many people that don't like me. I'm not mentioning names, but some people know exactly who they are that I'm going to say. Now, to all the decent fans out there that support my channel, that support me and everything, I respect. But the thing is, with anyone who disses and doesn't like me in that, it's like just burning hell. It's like just burning hell. Because the thing is, I could have dropped out anyway, I wouldn't care. And honestly, I don't. Because the thing is, when you've dealt with so much people's shit for too long and you want to get out of it, it's just honestly, it's an utter pain and it's a drag. Now, I want to shout out a few amazing legends that have helped me and supported me. Ewan McAnally, Kieran Wales, Leo Ball, especially, like three of them, as well as Blooming, as well as Shannon Mullen, Jamie Taylor. Jay Roberts, Adam Graham, and pretty much just everyone, even Louise Carlin and Caitlin Dow, as well as Colleen Elizabeth Lynch, Erin and Alison McGinley. It's just the message here, guys, is honestly, if you're getting so much hate, just to think of the things that are better in life. Because the thing is, with every hater that disses and just tries to make your life like hell, it's not the fact you have a sad life. It's that they have a sad life. I've seen that in so many people have ruined my street that I can't stand. And even at that, I've only seen it around my street. And there's so many people in my school that are decent. There's so many people that are sound in my school. Now, honestly, there are some people in my school that I don't really like. And there's some that I do. But honestly, just remember the saying, guys. Never judge a book by its cover because... At the end of the day, you need to realise and respect how that person's feeling because I might have been going through a lot of shit that I never knew was a lot of shit. But honestly, even to my nana, even to my Uncle John and my dad, that three decent people have supported me and helped me out. And honestly, I could I have done videos where I've gave my ma stuff, I've gave my dad stuff, I have gave most of my pal stuff. Most and i done it out of love. They didn't ask for it. Because i done it out of love. Just shows the fact I care. And I can actually do something nice for folk. And honestly, yes, I'm cutting down on ages. I'm doing like one a day. Sometimes I'm not even taking them. Sometimes I'm not even thinking about it. But I feel as if every day that will help me get through in life. Even though it does not. But it's just in my mind I feel it. But also as well, I want to shout out Ian Salisbury as well. He's a legend as well. Like honestly... Even Matthew Cumberland as well, he's amazing as well. And to Chloe McPike. But the message frankly here, guys, is don't let hate ruin what you want to do in life. Don't let hate ruin and destroy what is so precious to you. Because it doesn't come through actions, it doesn't come through words. It comes from in here, in the heart. Because as long as you have the right heart and you actually have the confidence to do something, you stick to it, you go for it, and you just, you do what is right for you. Like, I know most of you guys are sticking on at school, and it's right for you. Then, that's good. You guys, honestly, will get something. Me, if I did drop out, that would be through my choice and my life. Now, I wouldn't get a good, good benefit of it, but I'd still get peace and quiet. But I'm just saying it, guys, because remember the fact being that everyone is different. Every single person has their own mindset and their own freaking way they see things in life. And 
I honestly do want to shout Ethan Meekin as well because he is amazing. Like, he's been one of my best pals for years and has supported me for fucking so much. Also as well, guys, uh, if you want to subscribe to James McGonagall, actually, uh, please do so because I want him to at least hit about 400 subs, man, also as well. If you all can, please be a bunch of legends. Subscribe to the channel. Get me at about 495 subs and you're a legend. Also as well, if you do like subscribe to James McGonagall, uh, please do so. And get him at about 391 because he is one of my very best pals from literally from when we were in college and everything else and he deserves it. But honestly as well, just remember, mental health has no colours, death has no colours. You just take it each day as it comes and you succeed in life. Just do what you want to do and be happy. And also, get up the haters. If you're getting hate, just tell the haters to get it up them because they literally don't know what the hell they're doing with their lives. But I thank you very much guys for watching. Comment, like and subscribe. Turn on post notifications. Peace out. Love you all. Just continue being amazing and awesome. And just continue doing the things you love and the things you enjoy. And just continue succeeding. Peace.